Good morning. Today is Friday, June 7th of 2024, and this is the 159th weigh-in. Got my baby here, sniffing a message from another pup pup. Oh, baby, you're four years. Thor loves statues. He thinks they're real. I have to tell him it's a statue. It's an inanimate object, but he doesn't know. He thinks he found a bun bun. He wants to get it real nice. Hello there. Start with some low to high flies, high to low flies, and medium crossover flies. Okay. Same as last time. Ah. Was working with my developer today. Should have the the site tomorrow, and I'll be able to deploy it, start testing it, and then send him back uh, the changes I need to be that need to be made in order for it to be ready to start beta testing with people. So that's exciting. it is.
The one thing I'll say about being really consistent doing the same lifts, keeping the same targeted rep range, so keeping the same weight until you're ready to progress, it really lets you know if you're spinning your wheels. Because, you know, in a way, I've always heard this, but it never made sense. But if you're not adding weight to the bar, where's the strength coming from? So it's like, yeah, or where's the extra muscle uh, going? Because shouldn't it make you stronger if you have more uh, muscle fibers, denser muscle fibers, thicker muscle fibers? So in a way, it's like if you're constantly changing things up, changing routines, changing movements, it's just, as they say, almost impossible to track what your actual gains are when you're just doing day in, day out, uh, medium crossover fly for 90 pounds, five, five reps. If, if you go two months in a row and it ain't moving up, you ain't adding reps. You're not, you're, that movement is junk volume. It might be maintaining the size that you have, but it ain't putting on size. So that's when you can actually start manipulating variables to figure it out. I think I was, I've just never, never really settled into a routine that I trusted. And I think the biggest problem was I was always looking for this magic pill, this perfect routine, this perfect split, this perfect exercise, because I just wasn't willing to admit to myself it was because I was inconsistent. That's the reason I wasn't growing, not because I didn't have some perfect routine. In order to be consistent and make consistent progress, you have to keep doing the same thing so you can actually manipulate variables, you know? Change things up, ensure that you're progressing. So, it took a long time to appreciate and submit to that lesson. I'm glad I finally learned it. <sighs> no need to be sorrowful all the time. <laughs> you feel like you wasted. Because ultimately, it got you to where you needed to be. So how was it wasted time? Oh, well, if only I knew earlier. Well, I don't have a dick. She'd be my uncle, so. <sighs> no use in, uh... Thinking about what ifs or shoulda, coulda, wouldas. We just keep moving forward, right? One love.